Back home, a proposal to make changes to restaurant menus is picking up some support at Toronto City Hall. It would list calorie counts and sodium amounts alongside the prices. They do something similar in New York City, but not everyone is convinced that it would encourage diners to make healthier choices. CTV's Janice Golding reports. It's tasty, it's convenient, but how many of us actually know what's in the food we're buying? Not a clue. No, I have no idea. I'm sure that it's higher than what we should be eating, but... It turns out even though 60% of Canadians eat out at least once a week, most of us have no clue how much fat or sodium we're consuming. We want people to start saying, wait a minute, why is that salad 560? Those at the Board of Health today painted an unhealthy picture saying almost half of Torontonians are overweight. About a quarter of people over 20 have high blood pressure, largely because we're eating twice the sodium we need. Honestly, to be really harsh, I think the restaurants, many of the caterers are killing us. They are. They're making our children's fat, they're making us sick, and nobody's taking responsibility for it. All in favor? That's why the Board of Health voted this afternoon to urge the province to develop menu labeling legislation. Essentially, they want to see menu changes at chains with 10 or more outlets across the country or gross annual revenue of at least $10 million. Sodium and calorie counts would be listed on the menu board in the same size and font as the price. There's research on this, and in fact, it shows that people have a great deal of difficulty telling which meals are healthy and which meals are not, which meals are high in sodium, which meals are low in sodium. Uh, even trained dietitians have a lot of trouble telling the difference just by looking. There's a huge cost in terms... The Canadian Restaurant and Food Services Association prefers a voluntary program. An industry where meals are highly customized, so it's very difficult to provide all the information that a customer needs right on the menu or menu board. But the Board of Health says that won't work, and if the province won't act on their recommendations, they'll begin pushing for a City of Toronto bylaw in the fall. Janice Golding, CTV News.